What's up everybody? Welcome. Uh, and I am Solaris and I will be reviewing uh, the brand new treasure map units. Uh, the rare recruits that are out for treasure map Newgate evolution and Luffy happens to be a legend. So this is my first reaction. Everything's completely fresh. I'm doing the data mine right now. So just figuring out what Luffy does. All right, so Luffy is free spirit fighter quick. That's pretty standard stats or whatever. Captain ability, pull down by one for all characters. Quick free spirit HP 1.5. Attack by 5.25, by 5.5 with matching, 5.75 with a matching tandem or recovery orb, boost everyone else's attack by 4.75, makes strength dex tandem matching, heals crew by 5x at the end of each turn when HP is 30% or below, uses his own special. At the start of the next turn, only once per quest. Reduces silence by 6 as a sailor ability. Captain's free spirit reduces paralysis. Captain is a quick type, reduces burn. Okay, so, I mean, Captain and passives, the Captain ability is pretty bare bones. It's damage and healing and um, the standout bit is this uh, special activation. So that's why I'm waiting to the special activation to like figure out what it actually does. Music's a bit loud. Sorry about that. So his special reduces silence, paralysis, burn, duration by six, heals crew by 30,000 HP. So just right there. Like, Silence Paralysis Burn by 6, and if you do it right, you can activate it just when his health gets low. So that's pretty neat, and, I mean, if you're low health, you get a heal. Changes top row and bottom row, including block to rainbow. Okay, that's pretty solid. I think nothing wrong with that. Your crew has attack up. Boost color affinity by one turn, otherwise boost attack by 2.75 and by 3. Wait, wait, wait. If your crew has attack up, boost color affinity for quick and free spirit characters by 2.75x for one turn. Boost quick free spirit quick type free spirit characters and boost quick and free spirit okay i don't know why that tripped me up so this just means that he boosts quick free spirit by three and then any other quick and free spirit by 2.75 super special requires two of straw hats yamato momo and otama or hp is below 30 percent health so that should be a pretty easy one to fulfill if you're building around that element of his captain ability. Resistance silence by six. So he has a potential uh, 18 turns of silence removal. If you can get his captain ability off and then the super special and then the special, you could reduce 18 turns of silence. And that's kind of crazy. That's kind of scary at the same time. Uh, delay is ignoring delay. And boosted damage to delete enemies for by 1.75 for one turn. Quick into super quick. Guaranteed conditional boost. Yeah, this Luffy is pretty good. Uh, he supports Momo and Yamato. If inflicted with paralysis, reduces paralysis by 2 and heals by 4,000. Not by 4,000, but heals 4,000. I like it. 
I feel like Momonosuke has a lot of paralysis reducers though. Maybe I'm tripping and it's someone else. I don't know. I wish it was silence. Silence would have been really cool. But paralysis. Yamato is the key there. I mean, yeah. But I don't know. I, I just don't like how Bandai will give these crazy supports to like really, really obscure units that people aren't going to be able to always pull for. And then we'll get like treasure map units where their support is boost stats by X percent. All right, potential abilities. He reduces hunger, pinch healing. He has last tap, okay. Boost base HP, or base attack based on HP, up to 2,500. Okay. More damage is more damage. <coughs> Excuse me. Is it only two hunger? Oh, it is only two hunger. That is weird. Good catch. Alright, normal, power, small heal, power, uh, yeah, that's fine. Having the small heal in there is kind of neat for the occasional thing that needs a healing proc. Evade silence, reduces damage from strength. Kind of nice. It's no resistance to half stats, but it's kind of nice. Quick HP, speed level 5, fighter, attack level 5. We're really investing into a wide range of quick teams, huh? Quick fighter, uh, quick slasher focus on New Year's and now quick fighter, yeah. Next we're gonna get what, quick shooter or something like that? We used to have a decent quick shooter focus. Alright, special, 30 seconds. Quick teammates for defense, attack, if team has 5 or more fighters, targets team for 100% chance to remove stat reducing effects. So that's not half stats, that's any stat debuff. And the requirement is 5 uh, fighter class characters. I just stumbled over my words there. But it will remove it from everyone on the team. And then targets teammates for a heal. Surely he's only this cracked because it's a Luffy. I mean, the one downside, like, this is a pretty defensive Luffy. And unfortunately, funny defense teams aren't that common. So it may just be that this Luffy doesn't really fit in a funny defense team. And then his grand party stuff is standard. Uh, this Luffy looks funny. Good utility. Like, extremely good utility, including the orbs. Gives you one, if not two, boosts. Um. Yeah, like, a lot of good stuff there. I rate with you posting screenshots on Twitter. Yeah, this will be up in 20, 30 minutes, probably. Go ahead and post them. Silence, Paralysis, Burn, and Rainbow can see use, but no enemy debuffing. I mean, it's in his, uh, <coughs> it's in his super special, so. Alright, Nami reduces special cooldown to Quick Free Spirit Striker by one. She is Quick Free Spirit Striker. Sorry, I skipped over that. Boost recovery by 1.25, attack by 3.75, makes Free Spirit Striker recovery tandem beneficial. It's okay. Uh, restore special cooldown of herself by two turns. Heals crew by 500 at the end of each turn. So she probably reduces cooldown in her special by one turn. Yep. Reduces despair by six turns. Changes character's orb into a rainbow orb. Not through block. If amount of HP beyond max is 3000 or more. 
boost quick free spirit orbs by 2.75 for two turns boost uh quick free uh oh yeah quick and free spirit both but then all the other quick and free spirit characters by 2.75 if hp is 10 percent or below boost uh Quick striker characters attack by 2.75. Boost quick and striker characters attack by 2.5. Holy moly. Who reduces health in this team? <laughs> I see a lot of things that proc on low health. This is so weird. This is also so weird. So you need to both heal 30,000 HP and be at 10% or lower health. All right. Uh, she supports Carrot Speed, Otama, and Shinobu. That is an odd selection. Uh, inflicted with the inflicted with despair reduces despair by one turn and heals by four thousand. Okay, that's pretty good. Uh, yeah. That's pretty good for all of these characters other than Speed, because Speed only has one good rare recruit now, and that's not really a whole lot of flexibility, but Carrot, Otama, and Shinobu is pretty good. Uh, having options like that is pretty nice, so that's Nami. Uh, Hiyori is Free Spirit Slasher Quick, reduces special cooldown by Quick Free Spirit Free Spirit Slasher by 1, boost recovery by 1.25, attack 375, recovery tandem matching. Basically the same as Nami, just swap Slasher for Striker. Uh, Sailor ability heals 500 at the end of each turn. Uh, with Limit Break, tapping with a rainbow reduces enemies Free Spirit resistance, tapping with a Wano Orb reduces enemy Slasher resistance. Okay. That's pretty neat. So you can get one or the other, but not both. That's all, that's all I can really say about that. There's nothing else remarkable there. Removes poison, completely cancels blindness. <laughs> Removing poison, whoever needs to do that. This character's orb is Rainbow or Wano. Reduces counter heal and counter recovery duration by 6. Oh gosh. If amount of HP beyond max HP healed is 30,000 or more, boosts quick free spirit slasher character's base attack by 5,000. Otherwise by 1,000. Heals crew by 30% max HP. Kiku support on Roger Odin for 90% health cut. Poison slots on treasure map for sure. Well, I can pull that later today. Okiku and Toko is the support. Once per adventure, if character uses a special, heals 20% max HP, removes all poison. Is the Nami character good? She's pretty good. I wouldn't say she's bad. She is replaceable though it feels like yeah i think hiori with her utility is probably going to be a lot more useful i don't like this rainbow wano orb condition uh thanks goat ramus for the follow but uh Yeah, I... Hiori is probably going to be the more valuable one. I don't think Nami is going to be all that useful. Hiori seems like she's going to make this treasure map bad. I think there's definitely some room where people might encounter difficulty with the counter heal counter recovery. Because if you get health cut, and then you get hit with that... Uh, 
and it's not like the final stage where you can't just kill through it. That's what I'm anticipating. Like you'll still get hit by that because you're using a Luffy captain and he'll heal automatically. So this could be like he already could be like a linchpin unit. All right, and then <clears throat> moving on to the last one. Strength, white beard. Still striker slasher, but no longer the type he was before. He got a type change. So he reduces special cooldown of all by one. Boosts striker slasher attack by 4.5 below 50% health. Otherwise, 3.5 HP over 1.5 makes strength matching. I think these are the same as his unevolved version. Special ability, if 10%, if HP is 10% or below, applies increased damage taken by 1.5 for two turns, ignoring status effects, and locks chain to 2.75 and 4.0 for three turns. After that, reduces current HP by 50%, but reduces enemy barriers by two turns. I hate when they say then after that because I don't know if it means that this is no longer part of this 10% health condition. Uh, considering this is capitalized, I'm going to guess it does. This is the end of this 10% health condition. That's how I'm going to read it. Reduces burn by 5, so reduces barriers by 2, reduces burns by 5. That's really good. Uh, if your orb is tandem, increases increased damage taken by 0.25, increasing or applying to the special, and boosts damage against increased damage taken enemies by 1.5. Captain is striker or slasher. Locks the chain multiplier by 2.75 and 40 for two turns, which is the same as he does before if you're below 10% health. Either Omega damage or utility, but you can have both. It seems like, I don't think this is a after one turn thing. Like you get this utility by default. Like, there's. <clears throat> you can exploit all parts of Whitebeard's. <coughs> Excuse me. All parts of Whitebeard's special. But yeah, if you are, you're going to be under 5% health. So you just got to get somehow to 10% health, and then when you reduce your health by 50% again, it will be 5% or lower. Oh yeah, Ace would do that for you, huh? His support adds all 7% of all stats. And I think here is the same as before. Yeah, I believe that's all the same. This is Rumble stuff. Now 80% chance to avoid silence. Damage taken from decks by 20%. Attack speed level 5 for strikers. But his own attack level 5 if below 60% uh, health and then a special 26 seconds heals 40% health target strikers for attack up crit up and then targets one enemy with high HP for 3x damage I don't think that's anything to write home about so yeah there's the new units uh i'm gonna continue the data mine get all the information about the treasure map uh but overall i think luffy's really good uh he's a treasure map legend they're always boosted on treasure map if they're a utility legend they're especially nice to have because they're always there for you to build teams with so and it's luffy he has access to a bunch of supports team building with him is a walk in the park so yeah that's the new units uh thank you all for watching and 
catch you next time. Good night, good evening, stay safe, and I'll see you in the next one.